Don't let anybody define you just by your color. You can be born anywhere in the world. You have the, you have the right as any other human being to achieve anything you want to achieve. Wishing for a friend, someone. At 15, I learned about slavery. It brings my life into shambles. And I was so mad, so much in pain, that I went on to write a song on the album Aye. My first draft was hateful. My father listened to the song and looked at me and said, you as an artist cannot praise hate. You can't do that. You have to be the one that builds bridges. You gotta go back and rewrite the song. So I went back and write the song again. In 2012, I went to Kenya with my UNICEF as a Goodwill Ambassador of UNICEF. And I think the women, when they saw me coming, they saw me, they see my, my, my body language, they start singing a song. And that song just trickled down to my spine. It just gave me goosebumps. And I'm like, oh my God, I'm forgetting what it is all about. And that's when the concept of the album comes. I said, the world has to hear these voices, these beautiful voices, they are among the poorest of the world. But they are rich with one thing that nobody else on the planet has, is the strength and the joy of life. That's why I call it Ife. Ife is the kingdom of the Yoruba. At the same time, it means love. I've never worked with Mavis Staple, but I've been a great admirer of her work since I was a kid. She blew my mind away all the time. I mean, she is just a powerhouse of passion, and that voice is unique. For me, it's a blessing and an honor to be able to have a double beard with Mavis Staple. It's one of my dreams that's coming true. Every part of my body is ready for this. Nowhere else in the world till today even in my hometown, I've come, people have come with banner to welcome me the first time I arrived in Sydney. I love being in Australia and I love being at the Sydney Opera House. It's just an amazing place that the Australians have been able to create on that hemisphere. For us artists, it's a gift. The whole place is talking to you. It's a welcoming to any artist that wants to empower people, to use music, to call up on the world to come together. I can't even find enough words to express how I feel when I walk on that stage.